beer drinkers, this is Irish stops. And you're about to watch a beer review on the Trucking Grail. Okay, so today we are reviewing a beer from Innocent Gun that's aged in rum casks. Rum casks? Yes, rum casks. What this means is self-explanatory. Uh, they take a scotch ale that's, uh, it usually is a uh, smooth, somewhat of a bold beer. They take that and let it age in rum casks for a little bit longer than the uh, brewing process takes. Uh, and after it's aged, uh, what this basically does is it turns it into a heavier, a uh, little bit sweeter. Basically, what it, what it means is uh, gives it more what? Deliciousness. Yes, exactly. So I want you to uh, explain what a scotch ale is. Now to keep it short and simple, all a scotch ale really is, is an ale that sits in the kettle for a little bit longer, gives it that bold, sweet flavor that we all come to love and enjoy. Um, afterwards, like my partner said, they let it sit in rum casks. That process gives it, again, the more sweetness and the boldness of the flavor. So what you end up with is this decadent beer that is so immersely sweet, like anything else. Almost like a dessert beer. First impressions are everything. I don't get too much of a scent from this beer. Not enough head to really give a first example. But judging by Scotch Ales, usually they don't. So it's really going to be all in the taste rather than the scent. Right. All right, let's take it for her sip here. There's some sweetness to it. There is some sweetness to it. I'm getting some some chocolate flavors, some sweet mocha mm -hmm. um, on the finish. The dark color doesn't exactly say that it's heavy, and I don't feel like it's a heavy beer. You know, when you come, kind of put it to the light, it is a dark beer, but you can't. It's kind of a uh, amber, uh, an amber color. Mm-hmm. Smooth all around, no bitterness. Definitely. No hoppiness, really. Oh yeah. Um, almost drinks. Not like a beer that I've ever had before, other than other Scotch ales. This is definitely not a summer beer. Mm -hmm. All right, now comes my favorite part of the review, and oh, that's God, us. the chugability test. Woo! You ready for this? Buddy? I'm ready, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Cheers. Cheers. Too rich of a beer to be chunky. Oh, that is. I don't recommend it. It's a little too pricey. On the other hand, Ugh, that's oh all we have this week on the Drunken Grill. Thanks for watching. From me and Irish over here to good friends and good brew. So lots of bitches.